Hi, Louis in the UK. Um, Range Rover 2004 Vogue 4.4. And uh, I know they've got the M62 engines in them. And I know that it's the same sort of cluster uh, dash as the uh, BMW X5, I think E39 engines, V8, whatever. So I just wanted to have a little look at the cluster and just show you the menu and maybe how to reset it and how to unlock it. Um, there are other videos showing this, but most of them, is, it says it's for BMW. I just thought I'd do a Range Rover one. So basically, you can just get in the car without putting your key in the ignition or anything. You just press that, and then you'll see that just comes on. That's basically it. So then if you turn the ignition just one click, and then just press and hold that. I'll, just, I'll turn the music down as well then suddenly it'll, it'll take you into the test mode. I think there's 21 tests. Let me just turn the music down. So what I've learned is that, as I'm just gonna do it now, if you go, as you click it, it takes you up to, I'll do it fast, up to 21 test modes. So you can reset the, the dash as well using this. So what I'm gonna do is just, try and change something right if I try and change that if I click on that it'll say oops it'll say lock and uh, let me just actually no that's not correct so right, let me just do it again so if I try and change it lock on so what you do to change to get to get out of lock you you get the last five digits of your VIN off your logbook or under the bonnet or inside the door and you and you just add one to the next. So say if it's two, three, four, five, six, you just add two, add three, add four, add five, add six. You'll get a total number. On this one, the total number is 24. And this takes you out of lock. So then you press, go to 24. On, on this one, it's 24. Oh, sorry, I've gone too much. Right, I'm gonna have to do that again, I? Um, let's have a look. I, I don't know if I can go backwards. Right, oh, let's start again. <laughs> Right, so let's let's try and get out of lock mode. Get back to that again. Sorry. Let's go back to zero. No? So twenty-one tests. I, mean, I know one of the tests on here. You can even test the voltage of the uh, of the um, the battery. Right. This is, uh, right. Let's have a look at this again. Oh, it's come out of it. Right, let me just hold it down. Da, 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 da. Right, test. Then I'm gonna press this. Try and hold it down, see what happens. I've got to try and get it back into that unlock mode. Hmm. Right, lock on. Right, there we go. So let's go 24. Right, two, three, four, and then I enter it. And then that's, I'm not locked now. So then, so you're going through each test. Right, so let's go back to, let's just, just press test two, see what happens. All right, this is the one that resets everything. And if I can make it brighter, there we are. That resets everything, yeah? See? Basically resets the uh, MK3 sat nav time and date and stuff like that, and probably any preset. There we are, see? Right. Let's go to the next test. Let's see what it does. Next test. I'm just gonna click on every test and just show you what it does. I have no idea what they all mean, but I'm just doing it. Test six. I'll go a bit faster so we can go through them. Some kind of temperature one there. I'm trying to do this with one hand and my iPhone in the other hand. Right, there's the vault. The battery needs a bit of a charge. Test 10. I'm not sure what that means. Just 
gonna go right through to 21 and then that'll be it. So I'm not sure what gong means. I'm just going back and forth. 15, see? So basically I think they, they used these on the Range Rovers 2002, three and four. Then after that, I think they were upgraded. And with the BMWs, I think, and the X5s, I think it was 98 to 2003. And that's with the E39 engine, uh, V8s, four by fours. Right, what up to 21, last one. There we are. So the reset, if I press that, it will completely reset the whole system, including that back to anything you've pre-programmed and everything was zero off except for obviously the mileage and that's it and then I just turn it off turn it back on let's gonna start them up a minute check tail light I don't know if that, there we are see and if you look the date's gone back to zero time and uh, that's it I hope it's helpful thanks from Louis in the UK